Brothers and sisters, how you doing? It's Brother Wisdom here. I'm on the move today. I'm always on the move. We always got to be moving, always got to be building, always got to be seeking for a higher level of knowledge. That's why it's important for us to engage in meditation, vegetation, you know, the ancient uh, practices and rituals of our ancestors, what gave us true power, you know, and that power hasn't gone anywhere. Just believe me, our enemies don't want us to tap into this power. Why? Because when we tap into this power, we'll do the things naturally that they have to do on machines, which means that, well, we won't need their machines anymore. You understand? They got this whole system set up after they caused our planet to fall so that they can put their machines that they have in their universe and their planets on our planets. What all before, what did we need? All we needed was nature, the power of nature. And this is how we supposed to uh, uh, run and, and, and act. This is how we supposed to operate. That's why it's important for us to start building our power structures. We must study the, the, the structures of, of our um, ancestors, you know, look at the look at the Mayans and the, the Anunnaki's and the and the Olmecs, the Sumerians, you know, Kashmir. Look at look at how we created these power structures that are made of earth and 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 fire and water. You know, that's that's that has the the chem the uh, not chemicals. I'm sorry, that has the um, crystals and and metals. Uh, that's that's in them, you know, the, the, the different crystals, the different stones of power. You know, there's a very powerful stone that is highly magnetic that we use in a lot of our structures called lodestone. It's called L O D E, lodestone. Lodestone is what we use to make some of our pyramids. All right, believe me, and there are mountains. Of nothing but lodestone and how do we cut those pyramids you know you have to think about it go back in time think about how how were we able to cut those pyramids how because our bodies were so highly charged and magnetic and has such a uh, high electrical charge that we could literally use our fingers and our eyes uh, to cut we had laser energy that came out of our bodies all right, and this is what we have to return to. This is why we must power ourselves up. You know, the DMT that I talked about, you know, the, the meditation, us building the power structures. I'm posting all on Facebook about the power structures and how we, we, we've got to build. And this summer, we're going, to be some, we're going to be doing some building. We're going to be building frenzies this summer, building our power structures that we may bring the powers back to, to us because that's the only way. You know, so many of our people say, well, how do we do this? How do we do this? We have to build. In order to receive the energy, we must build. Um, when I began to uh, do the the different, um, when I began to build the, the, the power structures that, that we planning on building, I want to do a tutorial so that you will know how to do it yourself. Because we've got to do it all over the world. We've got to rebuild what was torn down. We've got to bring nature back to where it belongs. And nature belongs to us. You know, it's not our duty to sit up here and pay taxes and, and, and give these pieces of people, uh, these beings, pieces of paper. You know, how how prime, primitive is this? You know, that's something that, 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 that is primitive. Oh, you want this done? Well, give me a piece of paper with a number on it and then I'll give you this whatever you want you know how does so, so, such uh, uh, low frequency low level beings come into power if we didn't allow them to have this power so once we begin building these structures and begin finding out who we are then that's when we begin to tear down their world that they built in our world you know, we get to tear down everything that they built on our universe. You know, look at the airplanes. The airplanes, when we could, we are supposed to naturally fly. 
They got airplanes. The jet packs that they put on their back. We're supposed to naturally levitate. But we don't. Why? Because our people have 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 uh, taken upon themselves to live according to the ways of our enemies. You know, smoking cigarettes every day and eating all this poisonous food and drinking all these poisonous drinks. And then when you try to lead them and guide them the right way, well, you know, we all got to die. But we were not designed to die. None of us. We people of, of melanin. None of us were designed to die. I go back to the... Um, to to uh, the twenty third Psalms, you know, because the, the that book, the Bible, is nothing but a book about the cosmos. All right, that's one thing you got to know how to break the codes. But it says, um, "And I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever." Now, you just think about it. We were designed to live forever, okay? And our bodies are the house, the houses of our Lord. Our Lord is our heart. So during that time, we knew that we were not supposed to die. And we knew that we were supposed to live in this body forever. All right. That's why our enemies have taken upon themselves to create all these different chemicals and all these different um, types of weapons, you know, these different ways to, to, to destroy our spirits and destroy and destroy our bodies because they don't want us to return to the place where we once came from. They know so much about us that we don't know about ourselves. And this is why we must study. The whole point of studying this meditation, all right? Because to, the, to, to try to find the true metaphysics of who we are, you'll never find that in the book. You may have some people, you know, who um, give us some, some certain types of knowledge, all right? Now, believe me, they don't put the real knowledge out there because it has, in order for, for, for their books to go through, it has to go through this caucasoid, through his publishing company. You know, all right? So certain things, okay, you need to take that out because they don't need to know this. You need to take this out. You need to, why don't you add this right here? Add this in. So, you know, our people compromise just to get knowledge out, but the true knowledge that we that we need to give out is free and we should be doing free seminars everywhere. We should be doing just, just giving out this information to our people instead of trying to sell knowledge. Because when you sell knowledge, you're doing just what the enemy wants you to do. Give me a piece of paper and I'll give you this. You know, give me a piece of paper and I'll give you this. Like I said, that's primitive. That is so primitive. Right now, we're supposed to be in the air right now busting these planes up that's spraying these chemtrails you know we're supposed to be uh uh tearing down their power structures their their state houses and all the this is our planet brothers and sisters this is our planet and these these uh so many of our people are sleeping on us as well as many of our enemies they're sleeping on us too but i guarantee you the ones who are not they're watching every move they're watching me they're watching you they're watching everything that's going on all right. So the whole part of us growing is we have to rebuild our power structures. You know, we may not be able to build the pyramids right now because the pyramids were built from the air down. All right. The pyramids were built from the air down. All right. So we may not be able to build pyramids, but we can build the obelisk. All right. We can build those and we can fill them with copper and lodestone and 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 iron and crystals we can we can we can uh, uh uh fill them up and we can put that put those materials in the cement so that they can give off crazy energy in our neighborhoods and around our people it's important for us to build ourselves up because if we don't build ourselves up we're going to continue to be torn down and we don't need to be torn down brothers and sisters we don't need to be. We've been torn down enough. We've been torn. We've been we've been manipulated. We've been, been busted. We've been, I mean, you you name it. It's happened to us. Now is our turn to rise. Let's take advantage of this time and truly rise. But the only way we rise was to say faith without works is dead. You can have you can have faith all you want to, but once you begin to put in the work. 
once you begin to build these power structures, then will things begin to change. Collect your crystals, your crystals, your power structures. Eat the right food. Drink the right drinks. Think the right thoughts. The crystals help keep help you balanced, help you stay balanced and, 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 and release power to you. And, and the crystals catch negative energy also. So if any negative energy is trying to attack you, the crystals will, 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 will pull that negative energy and turn it into positive, positive energy and then shoot that positive energy out to the person who wants to be negative. So faith without works is dead. Faith is power. So what's the use of having power? Without putting work towards that power, you got to build. That's the only way you got to build. And if we don't build, then we can't grow. So the only way we can grow is we got to build. We got to build these power structures. So we got to stop saying, okay, well, you do this and I'll fund this. No, we got to get out there. We got to get our hands dirty. We got to get our feet dirty. We got to dig and, and create just like our ancestors did. And our ancestors, we did all these things because we did this for power for us because we as electromagnetic beings we knew who we were we knew the power that we possess within our bodies and this is what we have to return to brothers and sisters i mean it's 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 highly important that we we return to the stage of building the only way that we're going to save ourselves in the present is to go back to the past. The only way that we're going to save our future is to go back to the past. You got to go backwards in order to go forwards in, in a lot of senses. All right. So right now, because of this day and age and these caucasoids have this belief that they are, are, are uh, all supreme beings. Well, we got to go back into ancient history and pull that knowledge forward to the present so that we can show them. This is who we are in the past, and this is who we are in the present, and this is who we will be. We will be in the future, and you don't belong here, all right? You don't belong here. You know we gotta let them know you don't belong here. Once we give them that 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 type of that type of knowledge that they don't belong here, well then they're gonna be trying to get off the planet. But first we gotta start building all over the world. Africa, uh, uh, Asia, uh, here in this country called America, South America. Uh, um, uh, we gotta, we gotta, we gotta start building in Australia and Europe. You know, wherever we are, Canada, wherever we are, we gotta start building these power structures that brings us powers. We got to build, and that's the only way that we're going to win. In this fight is we have to build without us building. We can meditate all we want to because meditation. Well, I mean, I'm not saying that, I'm not saying this in a negative way. OK, but we can meditate all we want to. But until we start building the power structures, that's the, the meditation is going to it's going to bring us the power. But we're going to need that extra energy from the planet. All right. We're going to need that extra energy from the planet to 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 power us up. So. We got to get back to the nature, brothers and sisters. All this money and all this other collateral that, you know, they created. This stuff belongs to us. This stuff is free. There's nothing on this planet that costs anything. Everything is free. Money is an illusion. All right. But while we got this money thing, put our monies together. All right. Put our monies together and create power structures. And once we start creating these power structures from the from the right type of energy and the right the, the, the force of nature, that's when everything began to fall with them. We gotta make them fall. We gotta make them fall, brothers and sisters. All right, all power to the people of melanin. Gotta go. Like I say, I'm always on the move. I'm always thinking on a higher level, and that's what we should all be. Peace out to the people of Melanin. Love you guys.